Hey, 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 Mitsuko Easy here, about to slap you with some truth about ADD. Not that kind of ADD, rather adenosine deaminase deficiency. Uh, we're also going to touch a little bit on severe combined immunodeficiency disease. Uh, and and <clears throat> that, that, or SCID or SCID, is really the reason that we care about adenosine deaminase deficiency. We'll get to that here in a little bit. Um, what is ADD or adenosine deaminase deficiency? It is a autosomal recessive, uh, which we have another video on that if you're, if you're curious about what this means here. Autosomal recessive uh, inherited disorder where this enzyme, adenosine deaminase, does not work well. Um, and it, it, you know, who cares? So do we need this enzyme to work well? Yes, we do. And that's because its purpose in the body is to metabolize you guessed it, adenosine. And adenosine is, you know, we start talking like nucleosides. Um, when we try to make nucleic acid, nucleotides, those sorts of things, uh, we, we either get them from our diet or we metabolically create them. Um, now, adenosine deaminase is used both to digest, you know, meat and things like that uh, from our gastrointestinal lumen. Uh, it's also used just to turn over um, things in our tissues, uh, adenosine in our tissues. So if we don't have this enzyme, we can't do that. And the big thing is that these <clears throat> infants are able to make ATP, ADP, that sort of thing. And as you know, this is essential for life. This is the energy that our muscles listen to and use, that sort of thing. So they can make ATP, but they can't break it down. So what does that lead to? That just leads to more and more and more and more ATP. And through this kind of convoluted mechanism, what that says is we then run out of um, the nucleotides or the things that we need to make more DNA, and thus we can't make new cells. Now, lymphocytes, which are part of your immune system, are one of the, you know, a fastly turn turning over cell, right? We need a lot of them, we make a lot of them, we turn them over very quickly. Now, if we don't have, um, if we can't make new DNA, we can't make new lymphocytes. And if you can't make lymphocytes, that predisposes you to certain immunodeficiencies. Uh, it, it could be both T cell and B cell. Um, and that's kind of what starts leading us into this skid or severe combined immunodeficiency disease. Um, adenosine deaminase deficiency is the most common reason for skid to show up in, uh, in little people. And that's, again, because we can't metabolize uh, adenosine. So it leads to high amounts of ATP and DATP. Uh, we can't make new lymphocytes. Um, the other interesting part about this is that uh, this adenosine deaminase deficiency is the first disease that we tried to treat with gene therapy. You know, we start talking about the newest frontiers of medicine. This is one that we successfully, uh, you know, depends who you ask, relatively successfully treated with uh, gene therapy. So that is an introduction to adenosine deaminase deficiency, why we care, uh, you decrease your lymphocytes, T cells, B cells, you get at least a skid. One love.